Hello, my name is Aaron Stevenson, and I'm the cluster principal for the Cedar Valley Cluster. We're excited to highlight many things happening throughout the schools in our area. The Cedar Valley Cluster is composed of nine schools, including Cedar Valley High, Frontier Middle School, Black Ridge Elementary, Brookhaven Elementary, Cedar Valley Elementary, Desert Sky Elementary, Eagle Valley Elementary, Hidden Hollow Elementary, Mountain Trails Elementary, and Pony Express Elementary. As administrators, we meet frequently to discuss student achievement, events throughout our school, and ways we can improve communication and collaboration. We'd like to highlight some amazing things about Cedar Valley Cluster. The Cedar Valley High Aviation Program is the largest in the state of Utah. They have approximately 200 students enrolled and offer a full associate's degree in aviation science. All of these classes are provided on their campus. The school is receiving national attention for this innovative program. Frontier Middle School is continuing with its strong project-based learning priorities for students with their celebration of learning. Each student creates a project that is important to them and they invite our community to come and celebrate those projects with the students during an open house night twice a year. The Frontier Archery Club is thriving with 135 active members. They are also supporting the social and emotional well-being of students by starting a new Sources of Strength program. They have over 60 student peer leaders who are helping to connect and prevent bullying in the school. Black Ridge has committed itself to early literacy interventions for several years. They've accomplished this through a school-supported extended kindergarten program at the school where struggling kindergartners receive extra time and support by attending school for an additional five hours per week to focus on literacy. It has made a huge difference in their literacy achievement. Brookhaven's connection goal is to increase the amount of trusted adults in the building that each student has. One way they do this is through the Badger Bucks program, all adults in the building focus on finding classes and students who are exemplifying one of the six C's and give them a badger buck for the class to collect. Each specialty rotation, they're counted, reported, and collected, and the winners, three of them, earn the badger buck trophy and a glow stick dance party in the library. At Cedar Valley Elementary, they are wrangling up high levels of learning for every student. Their staff and community are dedicated to creating a school in which each student is a motivated high achiever who strives for excellence in all aspects of their education, including knowledge, skills, and dispositions. Students are sorted into one of four houses that focus on building positive character. This year, the school theme is We Choose to Be Kind. Here at Desert Sky, it's our first year and as the newest school in Alpine School District, we have had many incredible first accomplishments. We've been teaching our students that a desert sky, explorers are ones that climb to greater heights. CLIMB is an acronym that we use to model appropriate behavior and to develop explorers that are courteous, leaders, inclusive, mindful, and bright. Our teachers are working hard to connect with students and establish a warm and nurturing environment that is focused on student success. The adventure begins here at Desert Sky. At Eagle Valley, they've been working to improve their student culture and support the social emotional health of both kids and adults. As they work toward this goal, they're taking steps to refine their daily class meetings, implementing Stand for Kind and class presentations from their counselor, recognizing positive behavior with Eagle Valley stickers, positive postcards, soaring eagles, daily recognition and calls home. They're working to bring their staff together with some fun activities like staff spirit days, gingerbread houses, and a movie night where teachers can work on grades. Hidden Hollow is focused on blending literacy with community service and arts. In November, members of the student council collected unused books from families. They reorganized these books and teamed with their PTA to have a hot chocolate and book night. All were welcome to come get books that were new to them while enjoying marshmallows and candy canes in their cocoa. The Mountain Trails leadership team 
has been working hard to improve PLCs at Mountain Trails. They attended the Solution Tree Conference in October and came back with some amazing ideas about academic and social behaviors. They presented their ideas to the staff who are fully on board. At Pony Express, they've been working hard on their win what I need program. They provide a team of eight aides under the direction of their reading interventionist to give targeted interventions to the students who need it the most. They've also started a new program called Writer Habits. They focus on new habits every two months using their Principles 200 Club and the Wheel of Fortune. Hi, my name is Charlotte Ducos and I represent Cedar Valley High School on the Alpine School District District Community Council. I am so proud to be a part of our aviator family. I've been volunteering on the District Community Council for 14 years now, representing a number of different schools from the Eagle Mountain area. Due to the high growth rate we experience here in Eagle Mountain, my own children have attended four different elementary schools, three middle schools, and two high schools, all but three of which are still part of the Cedar Valley Cluster, and we've never moved. I've had the privilege of volunteering in some capacity at each of these schools, whether it be through PTA, school community council, district community council, or as a parent supporting my children's activities. Here's a shout out to our amazing Crimson Regiment Band family. I love our Cedar Valley Cluster schools. One of the things that I've loved the most about volunteering in our community schools is the way that our administrators care for and listen to our concern, the concerns of students and parents. Just recently, Jessica Gordon and I worked with our school community council and a team from Eagle Mountain City to address some traffic concerns on Aviator Boulevard. Over the coming months, weather permitting, the concerns that were voiced in school community council meeting will be addressed in very real way by our city to improve traffic flow and most importantly, student safety. During my time as a volunteer and even now as a teacher, I've witnessed time and time again how our parents and community come together to make things incredible for our students. I love walking through the halls of our school and seeing how parents have decorated the lockers for their student athletes or performers. I've witnessed firsthand the army of volunteers that exist backstage for theater, dance, ballroom and band. I've seen parents of athletes provide team meals all season long and I've seen our amazing PTSAs provide support for our teachers, administrators and students year in and year out. What an incredible community we have coming together unified in our desire to see our students succeed both in the classroom and in life. All of these things and more make me so grateful to be a part of our Aviator family. A couple of the programs that I really, really like here at Cedar Valley that are very unique. First, we have our Jet Fuel Soda Shack, which gives our students an opportunity um, in our business and marketing programs to learn how to run a business, to learn how to do marketing and things like that. This gives them an opportunity to have life experience and to learn how to run businesses and go out into their community with new skills. Another great program in our school is our freight farm. The freight farm was donated to Cedar Valley High School for, by META, and it's an opportunity for our botany and FFA students to have a life experience working on vertical farming, which is something that is very unique, and trend moving into the future that will help our students as they go out into the world, um, maybe with some experience that they wouldn't get anywhere else. It's partnerships like this that make our schools and our community so amazing. My favorite teachers and classes are Sharon Martisich. She is our athletic director. Uh, she's been a huge hand in my life, and I don't know where I'd be without her connections to people and the experience she's given me. And some of the classes and programs I'm personally involved with is um, Fly Crew. It is our business and sports marketing class. It, they do all of the managing for football games and any sports of the season. We run hype videos, we run the scoreboard, we do the game plans, we do the themes, all of that. And I'm also in Skybound, which is uh, our TV and broadcasting class. They make all the videos and those kind of align with each other because of the hype videos that I do in Flight Crew. They also uh, show up in Skybound and vice versa. And then I am a club member of DECA, which is the business and marketing club here at Cedar Valley, which is statewide and we go and compete. What I like about Desert Sky is that it's new, so like everything's new and like 
the library is really new and that we have great teachers here. The library here, it has like a bunch of benches, so once you check out your library book, you can go sit on a bench and then you can just sit there until it's done in the, and the librarian's really nice and she keeps the library perfect. What I'm looking forward to is in high school, they have wrestling and football and a bunch of sports and there's just a bunch of um, nice teachers in those schools, so. We appreciate the opportunity to partner with parents in the education of your children. We're grateful for the many dedicated students, parents, faculty, and staff who help us in our quest for excellence.